Good morning, family. Chauncey Pham here, Realtor in Dallas-Fort Worth area with Family Realty Group. And I will be coming to you today with a day in the life of a realtor video. So um, it is right at eight o'clock. I've dropped off the children. And so I am headed to the gym, hence if I don't have on any makeup. And no, you don't get to see me work out. I uh, thought I would have a little day in the life of a realtor type video. Give you guys a sneak peek into what I do for the day, how things go. Today I've kind of got a busy one. Um, gonna be hitting the gym, got a couple of home tours that I need to do, um, having lunch with a fellow realtor. And so just thought I would do a quick little video for you. So come along for my day. Girl, look at that body. Girl, look at that body. Girl, look at that body. I work out. All right, so now leaving the pit of hell, otherwise known as the gym. I just did crazy ass step class with the most energetic, skinniest girl on earth. And it was just so tragic. Um, one day, maybe I'll give you guys a laugh and some footage to see me doing step, but for now, gotta head home, make some calls. Um, this is a big part of it that a lot of people don't see is the calls. Um, being on the phone a lot. And so when I say calls, uh, some of it is prospecting, some of it is following up on existing deals, making sure that everything is going the way that it should go. So I've got about takes me about an hour, hour and a half every day. I've got my process pretty automated to where I'm not spending hours and hours on end every day calling and prospecting. Um, I get so many leads, guys. Thank you so much for all of your support. I get so many leads, you know, just online from my sphere. Hey, my cousin's brother needs to buy a house or you know my sister is relocating to Dallas and so I get so much of that every day that um, I just kind of follow up with all of those first thing in the morning after the gym um, and then after that kind of go to the office tinker around if I need to um, do any networking that I have for the day so about to head home make some calls uh, and then get dressed and head out for the day okay all right I'm home now um, this is the part that's not so glamorous. It's not fun. Hence why I'm not glamorous. Um, just got home from the gym and I got to pound out some calls. So these calls are going to be follow up calls to leads that I have existing, um, new leads that I may have gotten in the last, you know, day or so I've reached out to them. Now I really need to follow up. Um, also past clients. Right now it's tax season. I'm kind of reaching out to everyone, sending them statements if they purchased a house last year and just kind of, you know, seeing how the house thing is going. So this will be kind of boring, but hey, this is real turn for real, guys. A lot of it's not fun, not glitz and glamour, just pounding the phones, and this is where you make your money. So you gotta make those calls. Oh, also, CRM, huge, huge deal. So we'll do a video on CRMs. Um, it's basically managing um, your relationships and your, your customer base. Um, and if you have that working like a well-oiled machine, you will never ever feel like you're really busy uh, because your system will just kind of work for itself. So that's something I'm about to tap into, hit up all of these contacts and uh, see what I can make shake. Boring. Oh. All right, back in the car. I'm at it again. Um, this time I've actually been tasked with one of my buyers that um, works crazy hours, has a hard time getting off work. He wants me to go and shoot some video for him um, of a property. So I am headed over to that property to do a quick little tour. Fam here with Family Realty Group and 
Andrea with New Avenue Real Estate, Keller Williams. Today is just a lovely lunch date. Uh, with being a realtor, you know, it's a lot of networking going out, and this is just being in the day of a realtor, and uh, we're out for lunch. Food is my favorite thing. Andrea actually does a lot of sales up in the northern part of the Dallas-Fort Worth area in uh, the Prosper, Salina, Aubrey area. Uh, so if you guys have any real estate needs, give me a buzz. I know a girl. <laughs> yes, yeah, definitely at 380 quarters, one of the popping areas in the Metroplex right now. Still a lot of new development, still affordable housing, which is hard to find in DFW. So you can still get homes in like low 200s out there. Awesome, awesome. So that about wraps up my day. Uh, just to kind of run back through, you guys wanted to know exactly what a realtor does in a day. We wake up early. Well, some of us work out. I work out occasionally. Uh, do lots of showings, pick up, drop off funds, make transactions work, return a lot of emails, make a lot of calls, do some virtual showings uh, and some recordings, go to lunch with other realtors and have fun. Uh, so just busy, busy day today. Hopefully tomorrow will slow down a little bit, but hope you guys enjoyed uh, seeing kind of what I do in a day and hope that helps you with uh, determining if this is something you'd like to do. Okay, so I lied. Um, I thought my day was over. False. As soon as I got in the car from finishing up that video tour for my buyer, I just got a call from someone that I sold a house to about six months ago saying that their brother needs to sell their house and that he needs to sell it as soon as possible and he's only off certain days of the week and of course one of those days is today. Yeah, so I guess I'm not headed home. I'm headed to Roanoke. Okay, because I am a crazy person, and I think all realtors maybe do this. Whenever I see a house when I'm driving around that's for sale, I pull up the address in my phone if it looks like a nice house that I may have a buyer for, or even just want to know about and want to see the inside. Um, then I pull it up and I make an appointment and I go see it. So literally, as I just left this other uh, video tour that I made, I was just like driving home and I saw this house and it just popped on the market. And so I'm interested to see it. I may have a buyer for it. So you guys wanna come inside and like be nosy, take a look with me, let's see. <laughs> That was a bust. They didn't even have electricity in there. So um, if you're gonna have a house for sale, you want people to be able to turn on the lights and see things. But that house was very dark and kind of gloomy because they didn't have electricity. So next. Awesome day. Hope you enjoyed seeing what I do in a day and uh, catch you another one. Bye fam club.